Gonna be and I'm back with another video. Period. Today is video is endorsed by Younger Hair. Thank you so much for endorsing this video. Before I get into the video and all that good stuff, I would like to say a few things um, pertaining be doing business with me and asking me to do any type of hair review on your products or just any products in general. If you want to do business with me and you want me to review your products, then please. Be patient with me if I am reviewing your products. Please do not try to rush me, make me feel bad or anything like that because it's not going to make me hurry up and get the video out. I want to get the video out, right? And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get the video out when I can, right? The video is going to get out in general. I'm not going to take your hair. I'm just not going to take your money and just take this hair. No, that's not what I'm going to do. Your video will get posted. Your, you will have a review from me. I promise so please do not try to rush me make me feel bad or anything like that because I am taking my time to get your hair I'm only 16 years old I am still in school I take college classes and high school classes okay so please do not try to rush me or anything like that because it's not gonna make me get the video out sooner it, it's not and I'm just being honest secondly if you want to do business with me please be sure to Email me. My email is always in the description box down below under every single video. And I will also put it on the screen for you. Um, please do not comment down below and under my videos asking me to do business with you. I would like to keep that strictly private between you and me. So if you do want to do any type of business with me, then please, please, please comment down below. I mean, don't comment down below. Do not comment down below. Please email me. It's in the description box and it will also be on the screen for you. Now that we got that on the little white, let's get into the real video. Woo. Okay, so this is Younger Hair. Thank you again so much for endorsing this video. Now, this hair is the pre stretch braiding hair that is 26 inches and it's in the color 1B slash 130. This hair is, it's really good hair. You know, I didn't have problems with it doesn't smell or anything like that this is how long it is on me so it goes about down to my butt a, a little longer past like the top of it and that's how long it is it does go ombre at the bottom as you can see I start this hair with the single end twist, but obviously you can do box braids. You can do any type of hairstyle that you want to do with this hair. It is very easy to work with. It does not smell at all. The hair comes with eight packs of hair, which is more than enough because I've also redone these braids. I mean, these twists, I've had them, I had them in for a little bit, saw that they were getting old and I had more than enough hair to redo them. So you don't have to worry about not having enough hair. It is um, hot water safe, so if you do want to dip your braids, then you you can. You got it. Um, this hair comes in 1B, 1B27, 1B30, 1B350, 1B30, and then 1B27. So 1B30, 1B30, and 27 together. 
all of those hair is together and the hair comes it takes a little bit for the hair to come but obviously if it takes longer then you can just tell them contact them and they'll figure out what's going on and why your hair is not coming with you this hair is through amazon so the link will be down below if you do want to check out this hair once again this is the 1b30 hair so it goes light brown at the bottom and it's black at the top so yeah now for the packaging it comes in a bag like this right and then it comes with eight packs of these Ooh, i thought the bag was okay it comes that comes with eight packs of it, um these packs of hair this is what the little logo looks like it says save time save money easy braiding hot water to you so you can use hot water on it it is pre-stretched and it is 1b so you want again this is what it looks like before anything is done to it and yeah so it, i used five of these bags i used the first four the first time i did my hair and then i used one bag the other day to refresh it so it also comes with a crochet needle if you wanted to crochet anything with crochet with this hair you can it comes with a clip and and it comes with this little hand mirror for you that has little bowls and dresses and cute stuff like that on it that's what it looks like and then the mirror is on the side so yeah overall the hair is not bad at all you know it's pretty good hair good to maintain doesn't stink anything like that so if you do want to get this hair once again then it's in the description box down below thank you once again younger hair for sponsoring or endorsing this video um if you want to know anything else that i did not clarify for you about this hair then the link will be down below so you can click it and you can go do all your research and all this stuff before you purchase the hair now if you want to know how i styled this hair and how i got these twists then keep on watching hey guys okay so for this hairstyle you're gonna have to part your hair into different sections you can do them in box triangles you know to do you already know so you're gonna take the edge control that you're using and you're gonna put that around the area of your box or triangle or whatever shape you did first Okay, now once you've brushed all your edge control through, you're going to split your hair. You can either split it the way I split it, or you could split it diagonally, whichever way is comfortable for you. Now you're going to take the amount of hair that you want, depending on how big you want your twist to be, and you're going to place it on one of the twist, and you're gonna twist it around as tight as you possibly can so the braid is tight. After you do that, you're going to take the side that you twisted and you're going to put it over the untwisted side. And then you're going to repeat the step that you did in the first um, twist. You're going to twist it as tight as you can so the twist is tight. After doing that, then you're going to continue to twist, but you have to make sure that you twist tight and then twist again. Twist, twist, twist. So twist, twist twist you're going to be twisting your real hair and then you're going to twist over the other side be sure to add edge control as you go so you can blend your real hair into the fake hair so it does not stick out
Here you're gonna see me unravel the twist because a piece of my hair was sticking out. And you're gonna see me grab some more edge control, twist my hair in with the fake hair and then twist it over the other side. So my hair doesn't stick out anymore. Now, once you get to the end, you're going to burn the ends. This is how you make the twist stay and it will not unravel. So you can burn up some to get away some of the hairs that are sticking out. But you have to make sure that you focus on the end. Do not keep it at the same spot. You know, move it up and down, up and down. And then once you feel that it is secure, then you're done. And that is it. <laughs> 